question I thought about, but leave a like if you've enjoyed this. I don't. I don't think Bruce Wayne is the type to sell his own soul to the devil for for big bucks. What's up, Cosmonauts? It's your boy, Cosmo, and today we're here to react to what a Cuphead show actor predicts when, when the show will release. If you guys want to watch this original video, link is at the very top of the description. It is by one of my good friends, Livy. Be sure to subscribe to Livy and her comment section. Let her know that I, Cosmo, have sent you over to her. Now, before we react to this video, I'm not sure what this video is going to be about. I haven't heard any news from, from Netflix or Studio MDHR themselves confirming or announcing anything that's related to the Cuphead show. So today, I'm here to see what this video is about and what this voice actor had to say or predict regarding the Cuphead show. If you guys haven't been following up uh, on my last video a couple of days ago, I reacted to one of Livy's videos, her stating that there was this unrealistic release date for the Cuphead show on IMDb, and supposedly it was supposed to be released November 2021, which I don't believe for a second. I'm only taking it with a grain of salt, considering we're only a month away from, from that unrealistic release date on IMDb. And I'm still holding on to my word when I say 2022 to 2023, that's a more realistic uh, release date for the Cuphead show. So without further ado, let's do this. Peep, peep, llamas and alpacas, this is Livy, your professor of cupology, and we actually got something that was said by that same voice actor from the Cuphead show. As we saw on Friday, someone on... Okay, it was Friday. ...wrote that the Cuphead show is going to be in November, which no. a lot of us, we don't believe it. No, we're, we're, only, we're only a month away from that shit. We don't believe in anything nope. unless... Mm -hmm. Unless Netflix or Studio MDHR confirm it, I'm only taking it with a grain of salt. And this voice actor is Chris Wilde, which I hope I said his last name right. And he was responding to something that what does it say? Viewer and fan has said. Wait, what did that what did that tweet say? I don't remember seeing. I haven't seen this tweet on Twitter. I do follow Studio MDHR Netflix on Twitter, but I've never seen this tweet. What does it say? I think it just drops. No announcement. No trailer. No date given. We just wake up one morning very soon and get walloped. That a viewer and fan has said. And he said, this, I believe, makes the most sense of any prediction. Even my own predictions. This makes sense. He says, I think it just drops. No announcement, no trailer, no date given. We just wake up one morning very soon and get walloped. Yes. And this is almost a week ago that he said this. How did I miss this? I, I don't know how I missed this, but I like this. Me neither. I've never seen that tweet on my Twitter, ever. He did talk a little bit this morning. I agree with this 100%. Like, this is nothing new. This is nothing new when it comes to anything Cuphead. Because Studio NVHR themselves have done this before when they released it on, on the PlayStation. And they didn't say until they said, oh, it's out right now, so go get it. So I agree that this would be just a huge surprise. Now, when he says very soon, I'm going to tell you guys right now before you get on my ass about this or you complain to me or anyone else about this. He is yeah, including tomorrow. me, including he's me saying next week. And I hope he's not saying the first week of November. Because no, 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 Like, if something does come out on the week in Disney World, I will find out a way to do something about it. But I don't know what. And even if it has to come out later, it comes out later. He's just saying that it will come out the least we expect. <laughs> It'll come out when it comes out, people. Okay. It'll come out when it comes out. Like high expectations and false hope. It will be just a very, very pleasant surprise. And this is from a voice actor of the show, which by some of the hints he's been giving me, it, he's either voicing Ribby or Croaks. I may be wrong, but that's by some things that he's hinting. Well, again, I can't 100% confirm that, but I love that. 
I love that idea. I agree with that 100%. So you tell me in the comment section below, what do you think about this? Do you agree with him? Because I surely do. And even like some of the cards... Yeah, I'll get into that later on in this too, video. It kind of does say that it may come out um, unexpectedly. And no, I'm not just changing the prediction every time. I'm like, oh, you're just saying that now. No, I'm actually... It does a little bit make sense of what I've seen in cards. So what do you think of that? And also a random question. I know this is pretty random it's just something that me and some fellow youtubers were talking about this morning how what do you think if cuphead was batman <laughs> what if cuphead was batman <laughs> uh, i can't i can't imagine uh, cuphead being uh rich problem. even though he does like to gamble but that doesn't mean that cuphead is lucky <laughs> to be getting getting the money back at the at the casino No, I can't imagine Cuphead being Batman. I don't I don't think Bruce Wayne is the type to sell his own soul to the devil for for big bucks. Alrighty, my thoughts on that tweet from Chris Wilde saying no announcement, no trailer, no release date, and all that. He and his team of the Cuphead Show, they don't they don't want to say when the the Cuphead Show release because I'm sure even they don't know exactly when it's gonna be released because that puts a lot of pressure on them because if they were to say a certain date that it's supposed to be released on and then not have it released that that would, that would just piss off the the whole Cuphead community and it will make it seem as if they're as they're liars which I'm sure that they're not um, I'm sure it's because they don't want to give uh, their Cuphead uh, fans and enthusiasts uh, the wrong information I think that's what it's really I think that's what that tweet was about and just like Livy said uh, this isn't the first time they have done something like this just like she said they did the same thing when Cuphead was released on PlayStation and and in my mind, I think they're they might be doing the same exact thing with uh, the DLC because uh, they they said that the DLC might come out in 2019, but then unfortunately the pandemic happened. The Cuphead community were were pissed and impatient because it didn't come out the year to be released. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this. Uh, in the comments se in the comment section down below, if you guys are a Cuphead fan and enthusiast, just like myself and Livy, I want to I want to know what you guys think about this tweet. Do you agree with Chris? Said? Do you not? Or what well, what are your thoughts about it? Etc. Just let me know in the comments down below. Anyways, guys, I will see you guys next time. Please like, subscribe, and peace.